All right, so we've got a pan. We brought it to medium high heat, and we're adding a little bit of olive oil and adding some shallots. The recipe um, the, the recipe actually calls for shallots, but all I have is red onion, so that's what we're going to use. Cook that for a couple minutes, um, and going to add a little bit of garlic. And on top of the garlic, we're just going to add a little bit more olive oil, um, just so it gives it something to cook in. So you're going to cook that until the garlic's fragrant. Um, mix it all around and remove it from the pan. Give the pan a quick, quick uh, wipe, but it's hot, super hot, so be careful. But you don't want anything in the pan to burn. So we're going to add a little bit more olive oil to cook the mushrooms in. And these are the smallest little baby chanterelle mushrooms I've ever seen. Yours are probably going to be bigger. Um, you can eat the stems on the smaller ones. A lot of people remove the stems from the large ones, but um, I'll just remove them and cook them and eat them because I don't mind chewy stems. So add a little salt to bring out the water in the vegetable. Add a little pinch of uh, black pepper and cook this for a couple minutes. All right, so I've got my handy butter knife here, and I'm getting ready to add a little bit of butter to the pan. Um, you're, you'll see that once the butter is added, it smokes uh, pretty easy and burns pretty easy. So um, if it's burning too much, bring down the heat a little bit. Uh, so we're going to just mix that up. Let that soak in and add in the shallots and garlic. Mix it all up so all the flavors integrate and are delicious, and enjoy your mushrooms.